Good afternoon, Franklin Township. This is PJ Parker from the Franklin Reporter and Advocate, and we are here today at Leaf House Cannabis at 900 uh, Easton Avenue, and that's right near the IHOP and a few other locations. You can't miss it once you come into this plaza. And why we are here is to tell you about cannabis and why it's not only legalized on the fun side, on the recreational side, but there are aspects to this green plant, this leaf that you can get at Leaf House that benefit you on a health side. And here to tell us a little bit more about that is Shawnee, who is the CEO, the owner, and whose idea this was, as well as Tim, who is the general manager here at Leaf House. Tell you a little bit about cannabis and why you chose this industry, Shawnee. Hi, um, well, thank you, <laughs> PJ, for having me here. Uh, well, I, I chose this industry, again, um, I, as many of you know already, I've been in this in healthcare industry for 15 years already, and um, cannabis is kind of very close to, to this, to my industry, right? So it's, it's an extension to the um, uh, healthcare aspect mm -hmm. of it, but it's on wellness side. So, I was thinking, why not? Mm -hmm. If um, cannabis uh, has been used centuries, mm -hmm. right? So mm -hmm. it's, uh, and everyone knows um, it's... Uh, it's fun side. Fun side, right. no, not, exactly. not only fun, but medicinal, the mm -hmm. use of, um, for medicinal purposes. And me personally, I told you like before that I do have uh, chronic uh, conditions that I have to kind of uh, treat, mm -hmm. and it was my choice. So mm -hmm. my choice to go with um, on using the wellness uh, mm -hmm. products mm -hmm. versus um, um, pharmacy, I guess, pharmaceutical products. Mm -hmm. So um, it has a lot of um, positive effects. Um, I'm a I can't. No, you you don't you don't need to disclose anything yeah. personal, but Franklin, this is a woman who cares. When you walk in this door, if you have something that you want to talk about right from your heart, Shani is there for you, and she will discuss what the benefits of cannabis are for you personally, and talk about just about anything else that's on your plate. Uh, but your experience, you personally have achieved health benefits from this, correct. and you want to share that. You want to yes. put that forward into the community. Right. Um, you know, we live in all this right now. Uh, it's a very hectic uh, era, I would say, um, and um, we all constantly on computers working, working. All we do is just work mm -hmm. and kind of exist, and it's tough. Uh, we obviously, I develop also anxiety, stress, and it, mm -hmm. it does really help in this type of situations mm -hmm. to de-stress, to be able to function, to be able to run businesses, uh, to be able to be a mother, <laughs> mm -hmm. a wife, a sister, a daughter, so it takes, you know, uh, cannabis did um, bring me positive effects, um, and thanks to it, I guess, I would say that I'm able to function and be able to help others. So wow. hopefully, hopefully, people will be able to research more, because um, it's, it's basically right now, it's, it's, it's a stigma that we need to just take away from people and um, just do, I guess, do readings about it, uh, do research, and you're always welcome to, our, to come to our store. We have great team who knows, who's very knowledgeable about cannabis, um, who, could, who could help you. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm glad you touched on the idea of the, the stigma of cannabis, and for decades, it was hush-hush because it was illegal. It was a drug. People went to jail for possessing it. Now it is discovered to have a true health benefit to all of us. And that's the side that I think most people who are still thinking, oh, cannabis, oh my God, Mary Jane, marijuana, weed, oh my God. There's a little bit of a panic mode involved in that because it's now legal, because it's now available. And what Shani and Tim and the rest of their team are here to educate you about is how it can actually benefit you on a health level. Yes, correct. Mm -hmm. So we, we are very grateful that you've, you've started this here, Shani. Uh, you are a, a formidable woman business owner in our community. We are thrilled that you are a part of our community. Thank you for having me here oh, in yes. the community. And uh, I'm blessed um, to actually be here. 
um, that um, Franklin Township was able to open their arms uh, to us and to be able to open our first actually cannabis right? mm -hmm. uh, dispenser here in Somerset. So I'm, I'm glad to be here. Okay. What, what can, uh, when somebody walks in the door here, first of all, what are your hours? Uh, what are our hours? Uh, uh, from Thursday to Saturday, we are open 10 to 9 p.m., 10 a.m. Mm -hmm. to 9 p.m. And from, uh, from Monday to Wednesday, 11 to 9 p.m. Sunday, we're open 11 to 7. Okay. And if somebody needs to just sit down with you and have a, a consultation, is that available? Of course. It's okay. always available. We have uh, seven um, sales associates who are very professional, and they know their stuff. Mm -hmm. So okay. be able to answer all the questions and educate you, actually. And we do have educational Wednesday, right? On Wednesdays, every yeah, other we Wednesday. Do, we do some educational things mm -hmm. on, on different Wednesdays mm -hmm. of each month. Okay. Well, Tim's going to give us the overview of what his role here is. He, he's, the, he's the weed guy. Yes? <laughs> Tim's the weed guy. Yeah. But Shani is the heart and the soul and the experience of this business. So she's, she's the one you, you want to connect with. Uh, she's going to tell you the truth. And she tells it not just because she's learned about it, because she's educated herself about it, which she has, but she lives it every single day. So, Shani, I know you are a busy CEO, and you have to get back to work. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you. Can I make a quick, quick announcement? Absolutely. We're actually having, on March 15th, we're going to be having an ed educational seminar for um, for people of Franklin Township, and not only Franklin Township, I mean, whoever lives here, whoever is, is interested to come to this town, uh, it's gonna be from nine to 11, it's a breakfast and learn at IHOP here at 900 Eastern Plaza, um, so uh, Eastern Avenue, so please come, it's from nine to 11, it's breakfast, um, actually, uh, IHOP, breakfast. It's a very nice breakfast and coffee and we, we, we will be able to educate you on not only cannabis, but we're all having a healthcare event. So it's mm. going to be eye doctor's office are going to be there, physical therapist's office, um, home healthcare agency will be there, us, uh, Leaf House will be there as well because we are part of wellness. We'll, we will try also to bring maybe some um, yoga or Pilates teachers, but please, everyone is welcome. Mm -hmm. Well, that sounds like an amazing event, and it'll show Franklin uh, connecting the various health modalities and how they all can wrap around and with cannabis as an element of health. Yes, correct. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we decided just why not just gather with the whole community and especially all our neighbors. We, 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 we're trying to come together. Mm -hmm. This is my, I guess this is my goal. Okay. That's the goal of Franklin Township, and we're still thrilled you're here. Thank you so much. You. Okay, this is Shawnee, ladies and gentlemen, of Franklin Township. And uh, Shawnee, you want to introduce Tim? Yes, Tim is our dispensary manager, so uh, he has, uh, I mean, he's very knowledgeable, knowledgeable in cannabis. That's why he's here. Um, we always go, he's an expert, so whenever, like, even I have questions about my, my parents or like whoever, right? So whenever, whenever I have questions, I always go to him. So he's able to answer any questions in, in, in terms of cannabis, everything. Okay. Wonderful, you got a good team. <laughs> yes. Okay, now if you guys could switch places yes. so Tim can have center stage. Tim, tell us you and what your background and expertise is and why did you plant yourself in Leaf House? Um, well, I've been in the cannabis industry for close to 15 years legal. Uh, I was started in the medical field in California, so Prop 215, uh, and then I went recreational with a couple different dispensaries. Uh, I've been certified by multiple avenues of education for cannabis. Um, I've worked with some of the best breeders, best growers, best dispensary owners. I, the list goes on and on. Um, but I got into this business because cannabis has helped me so much, mm -hmm. even on the recreational side, um, that I wanted to bring that help to everybody else. Mm -hmm. if, do you mind sharing a little bit about what your personal experience had been? Uh, yeah, to be honest, I uh, unfortunately started using cannabis at a fairly young age. Mm -hmm. Sorry, Mom. Um, <laughs> she didn't know, right? No, she had no idea. Um, but uh, it helped me a lot with anxiety, social anxiety, breaking out of my shell. Mm -hmm. I got, you know, and countless amounts of new friends using wow. cannabis. And, you know, when I moved, first moved to California was really when I, it started on the 
the educational front, mm-hmm. um, learning what, you know, growing up, I, I, I went to my weed guy and he mm-hmm. was like, here it is. Mm-hmm. Getting to California, you have endless amounts of choices, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. So that that's when my educational uh, portion of my career started. Mm-hmm. Um, and I learned, you know, what strains go with what ailments, Mm -hmm. what delivery methods uh, being used are are the best for each individual person. Mm -hmm. Um, And that's what I bring to Leaf House is, uh, you know, the vibe of making sure that every single customer gets exactly what they're looking for. Mm -hmm. And I'm not going to stop until they do. You know, Um, I have 100,000 people probably that I've helped in my career. Um, And... uh, Typically, I don't miss. No. Wow. Oh, my gosh. That's quite a testimony. Why did you choose Leaf House? Uh, You know, Shawnee and Dimitri, Leaf House in general, they just welcomed me with open arms. Um, And, you know, they really have the same mentality of me with the use of cannabis and and the way that we run our store. Um, They kind of, you know, have my back any which way I go, um, which is super important to me. I have had many, many bosses in my career of my <laughs> of my cannabis career, um, and not all of them were anywhere close to to having you know Aww. to being as as well rounded and you know understanding of the plant and. Mm-hmm you know, spreading that love to the customers. Mm-hmm. The support that Absolutely. you have. That's what, that's what I have sensed about, about this organization. When you walk in the door, there's a smile on everyone's face, mm-hmm. and people are really genuinely interested in helping you. Mm-hmm. So it's, uh, it's a little intimidating, I guess, when people walk in the door, because for all of these years, it's been a no-no. Mm-hmm. Now it's very much a yes, yes, yep. and here's why, yep. and here's why, and here's where at Leaf House. Absolutely. Um, you know, the, it's wonderful that my home state has, you know, re- uh, recognized and legalized recreationally. Mm-hmm. But even if you're a recreational patient, you still may be using it medicinally, even if it's subconsciously, mm-hmm. you know, from stress to anxiety to pain management to inflammation. Mm-hmm. Cannabis is by far the most versatile plant on this planet. It was put here for a reason, and we're going to keep, you know, pushing it to everybody instead of using, you know, it, it's okay to use pharmaceuticals and everything like that, but with the insurmountable benefit of cannabis mm-hmm. and, z- you know, potentially zero side effects, mm. uh, and, unless you eat too many edibles, <laughs> you, might, you might get a little hungry. Um, but the, I mean, there's virtually no side effects mm-hmm. and, and it's, it can work for every single person. Yeah. It's very subjective person to person, but you come to Leaf House, we'll find the right product for you. Uh, I think we should make it very clear that you are not a medical professional no. per se. You are not a medical doctor, nor is anyone who works here. So the advice that is that is given is from an educational perspective as to what the plant is and what its benefits can be for your particular situation. So you're not prescribing, you're yeah. advising. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Plus we're absolutely. Uh, from our personal experience. So we, we, we're talking, you know, from our personal experience. So we're not doctors, obviously, and um, it, if it's helping a lot of people, so mm-hmm. it, you could just put two and two together. <laughs> so. And again, uh, Leaf House was the first, I believe, the first cannabis location in Franklin Township in Somerset. Uh, it continues to grow. It continues to share a reputation that it says what it means and it means what it says. And every person in here will give you a smile and will know what the product is that you might be looking for. After you describe what it is you might be looking for, they're kind of able to zero in and help you. Absolutely. Um, And even if we miss on the first chance, give us a second chance, we'll get Mm -hmm. you in the meantime. Mm -hmm. You know, Mm -hmm. it's uh, it's not easy to do um but you know with my background and everybody else's background that we have as a bud tender uh they're gonna they're they actually care they really do want to help you Mm -hmm. so we're gonna do that until 
Councils come yeah. home. Yeah, right. until we can't. You know. I, I know when I spoke with Dimitri last time we saw each other, uh, he mentioned a VIP club. Can you address that, yeah. both of you? Absolutely. Um, so we have a, a VIP club here at Leaf House. It's uh, basically a loyalty rewards program, but designed a little bit different than uh, other dispensaries that I've seen in the state. Um, you have uh, points that you accrue. We have specific notices on deals and you know, fun activities that we have. Mm -hmm. um, we do, you know, games for the customers, make it a little bit more interactive. Mm -hmm. um, and the VIP club will show you all that. You opt into the email or the text and we'll send you everything directly to your phone. Okay, how does somebody become a VIP member? If you uh, come to our store, we have plenty of QR codes around for you to scan um, and uh, we'll get you signed up in store, no, no problem. Mm -hmm. Okay, is there a website that someone also could sign up at? Uh, you can go to leafhouse.com, mm -hmm. and the loyalty program is up in the top right corner, I believe. Okay, very cool. Well, yeah, uh, VIP Club also gives you access to all of our private events, and we're hosting oh, one, actually, a big one um, on February 15th, which is going to be a, a private Valentine's event. Mm -hmm. It's closed only, it's actually only for our VIP club members. Mm. So that's why you need to come to the store to sign up. Yes, it's February 6th. You better come here quickly, Franklin. Yeah. Well, today is February 6th. Yeah. Oh, today. They have nine days, right? So you, you have your marching orders. If you want to be at these very special events, the first one being on February 15th, you can only come here if you're a VIP. So you have to come here, which will be a wonderful thing for you to do anyway, to see what the industry is and to see how well it's organized at Leaf House right here, 900 Eastern Avenue in the IHOP Plaza. Your hosts, Shani, who's the CEO, your general manager, Tim, and the rest of their staff here who know what this industry is and they can educate you as to how it will benefit you. That's Leaf House on Eastern Avenue. I'm PJ Parker, Franklin Reporter and Advocate, and you know we'll be back.